Bobby, what have you done? I say. What do we do now? You run. Do you understand me? <gasps> okay, well, the results from the post-mortem are in. I'm very surprised to say that the evidence corroborates your statement. So? It means you can go. <clears throat> Just bear in mind, this might not be the end of the matter, though. You see, the initial crime report threw up some confusion. Some of Mr Blissett's personal effects were missing. His hat and a book or a, a notepad. He was seen with them earlier on CCTV. What can you tell me about that? I promise you, I have no idea. <sighs> OK. Also, there was some unexplained bruising to the back of Mr Blissett's head. Did you attack him at any point? No. No, I was trying to get free of him. You said the post-mortem shows that I'm telling the truth, so... Did you really act alone, Mercedes? Or am I missing something? Or perhaps someone who might have helped? There was a struggle. I couldn't breathe. I couldn't see. He was coming after me. I was panicking. So the answer to your question is no. You are not missing anything. It was just me and Silas. Nobody else. OK, then. Can I go? For now. It's over. She didn't tell him anything. No. But Bobby, we need to talk about what you did. We had got away from Silas. And you deliberately pushed him. Didn't you? Yeah. Why, why? Why did you kill him? Because I realised he was a bad man. You killed someone. No, I, don't, I don't want to get into any trouble. Well, you took someone's life and that is all you can say. Do you realise what you've done? I mean, you are a child. Please don't shower me, Mum. I'm really sorry. No. You know the rules. You don't say that word unless you mean it. And maybe when I were teaching you that, I should have thrown in the part about not murdering old men, too. You know, I've had all night to think about this. Working it back, running it through my head. Thinking, where did it start? It started with Liam, then Silver. You hated Liam for tearing our family apart, but you hated your dad even more for walking away from it. He said he'd never leave, and then he lied! I didn't want you to get hurt! Oh, and that's a good enough reason to walk away from Silver in the explosion and leave him to die! What the hell is wrong with you? That is a question I'd love to know the answer to.